Hey guys, it's G and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm not going to ramble, we're going to go straight into this video and I'm going to be hitting you with a short but really funky and fun styling video. I'm going to show you guys some of my favourite like outfits to wear at the minute, adding some colour into your wardrobe and you know little tips and tricks for my short girls and petite girls out there. Without any further ado, let's get on into this video. So for this outfit, we are going for colour, which is something we don't normally do. I am not really a colour kind of gal, but I'm really trying to add more colour into my wardrobe. And I actually paired these two items together just because they fit me really well. And I just thought this is a great shout for girls who are small and petite or short girls do struggle finding the right outfit. So in the summer, I just think that is like the perfect little. So this top is from Pull and Bear. This is like the most gorgeous ribbed top that you can wear, obviously tucked into a bra. This fits me perfectly. The lighting's going in and out quite a lot. This top you can wear fully buttoned all the way to the top or you can leave it open and just got that little extra skin showing which obviously if you don't like that you can cover up if you do you can leave it open there's another button at the bottom there which i have just left closed but you can literally unbutton it all the way down and then it's got these gorgeous little collars on it as well it's so pretty just open and i thought you could actually wear this with jeans you could wear this with cycling shorts you could wear this with leggings joggers joggers looks beautiful with this i'm actually really wanting to pair it with joggers for an outfit because this with joggers, it's going to be like the cutest outfit ever. Crop tops are so hard for me to find, but this from Pull and Bear fits me so perfectly. And I love how you can adjust it to whatever you like. This top is also backless as well, which is why I love it so much. So that's the top. It's nice and ribbed. We love it. It's white as well. So it's a pretty good basic to have in your wardrobe. These gorgeous ribbed cycling shorts. These again are from Pull and Bear. I found these in the shop and I thought the sizing was amazing. They came in like extra small, small to medium, which is what I'm wearing right now. So I'm wearing the second size up, which is mad because the extra small is so tiny. These fit like a glove, they're really stretchy, but it's that material that basically springs back. So it gives you a lovely like shape on your body, sage green color. I love it and especially with white in the summer color is so in fashion at the minute so if you're short like me or you're petite or you want to find some good clothing bits that you know will fit someone who is smaller in size or you're smaller in size and struggle to get tops and leggings and cycling shorts and definitely check out pull and bear because this brand I've been sleeping on this band for ages and I'm obsessed. I'm definitely going to pick up more colours in these shorts. I've just popped on these gorgeous sunglasses. And if you guys know, the whole like coloured sunglasses trend is massively in fashion at the minute. And I picked these up from ASOS. So these glasses have got a green frame and an orange lens. And I think these look so cool and paired with my leggings. I love it. It is so summery. It's a really fun way to add a bump of colour into your outfit. Say you're wearing like all black. This is going to look so cute. I feel like these sunglasses are a great way to add a pop of colour into your wardrobe. Especially if you're wearing quite a pretty boring outfit. Probably the most brightest outfit you guys have ever seen me in. <laughs> to call my favorite fashion combo which is bucket hats and shirts this shirt is from pretty little thing it is very oversized on me but that is just how i like my shirts so my bucket hat is actually from nike and then i have just a plain black bandeau top which is from pretty little thing and then i've got these cycling shorts on which i absolutely love i've been hunting for cycling shorts with this waist detailing for so long and i found these on asos but it's actually from a brand called as you and a lot of that stuff fits me which is huge because most brands can be very hit and miss with sizing but as you the brand is such a cool 
brand for fashion they do some really amazing pieces but i think i got them in the sale for four pound but they've got the waist detailing which i absolutely love uh, that is my whole outfit very basic but it doesn't look so basic when i put all the pieces together especially with the little detailing with the shorts the hat the shirt i love wearing like a big white oversized shirt against the black just because it gives it a bit of pop and i love white against black i was going to stick a plain white shirt over for this but this has a slight bit of like black minimal checkered on it which I bloody love so with this outfit you could pair this with a blue shirt a pink shirt you could wear it with a checkered normal basic style you literally could wear this with anything and I think with the little details with the shorts and then the checkered on the shirt like the really minimum check minimal checkered I think it really ties it in together <laughs> So this outfit is one of my favourites. This is a mini dress, but I wear a mini dress as a midi because I actually prefer long dresses on me. I think these types of dresses make me look longer compared to like the shorter dresses. So this dress is actually from ASOS and it's from the brand As You. It's like a gorgeous soft ribbed jersey material it's really lightweight it's not too hot in it it's long sleeved so that's like one of my favorite things in outfits and stuff when it's long sleeved that's a massive tick of the box um and it's the most beautiful navy blue color i love this color especially now i've got black hair i think this just really complements it paired with black navy and like blue with black is again one of my favorite combos so i paired this with my black belt and then obviously a black shoulder bag i love this outfit and then i've got like my big chunky boots on which i'm just like living for this vibe it's very police vibes casual but glam at the same time it's like i'm going out for dinner but it's not too like night outy because it's like a long dress it's covering you but i've got like the button up with the collars like this dress has so much detail to it and i love it it just pairs so nicely and it would look so lovely if you're going out for tea or dinner or lunch with the girls or brunch honestly bury me in this because i love it that much and then something if you want to add a little bit of spice to your outfit i've actually grabbed these yellow aviator style sunglasses and i think these look so cute with the blue blue and yellow again another great combo and they really pop if you're going out in the sun i just think it's a whole vibe and summery but bougie i absolutely love this <laughs> This is going to be a whole nother series, but I have been trying so hard to, to get into pink. You guys know I am not a pink girly girl, but since I've had such a huge love of shirts, I found this um, beautiful, like, I don't know what you describe this pink, this tone of pink has got to be my favourite colour of pink ever. It's so beautiful, it's like a muted um growing up pink in a weird way it is so gorgeous this shirt is from h&m i've got a little bandeau on it just because it's easy to throw on it's easy to layer as well then i have on my cycling shorts they're only about four pound they are actually cycling shorts i can get away with wearing them a lot longer but all i do is if they're a bit longer i just ruse them up I can actually get away with pulling these shorts up a lot higher so they're basically cycling shorts on me. So anyone can get these cycling shorts. They're just £4, the jersey, and I think they're in the colour cream because I don't really like white that much. So cream is like a bit, you know, less harsh. Um, I paired it with my black belt 
and I also paired it with my Prada bag. These two are what I always pair together, but with my hair, I feel like it really ties it in. And then, of course, to tie in with the black, I also have my beautiful chunky boots from Zara. They're just a flat chunky boot. I absolutely love them. I like pairing the pink with the black. It just gives it a bit of an edge. This is my pink shirt. I'm so glad I bought it. I actually have three other pink shirts that I'm dying to style. I actually think I'm going to do a dedicated video on how I style my different coloured and patterned shirts. If you want to see that, let me know in the comments and give this video a thumbs up. Also, I'd love to know if you want me to style a different colour as well. Like, a week only styling pink, a week only styling yellow and blue, because that would be such a good challenge. If you are afraid of colour, this is your sign to go out your comfort zone, wear a bit of colour, grab some pink, and style it in the way that you feel comfortable. This is amazing, and I actually got this H&M shirt in, I think it was a size extra small of a small, so it's not oversized either, it's not as oversized as my PLT shirts, this is like an average this is just an average size shirt, so I really love pairing it with black and white. You could wear an all black outfit, but I think with the boots as well, it just gives it that edge, which we all need in our lives, especially me with my black hair. It just ties it all in, and I'm obsessed. I'm so happy. I can't get over how much I love pink. I feel like I've transformed as a new woman at this rate. So I always say the recipe for a good outfit is whacking on a pair of sunglasses. These sunglasses are stunning. I'll actually leave them linked down below in the description box. But if you want a nice pair of sunglasses, different styles and different shapes that are really, really high end quality, I definitely recommend going on Key Australia. I love them. I'm sorry, but I'm just obsessed with it. I think this is a whole mood. I can't get over how much I love this pink on me. <laughs> video i'd love to hear your thoughts on more episodes of this fashion series that i'm going to be doing it is where my heart is the most i love fashion it is what gives me so much confidence so if you'd like to be involved and put in the comments suggestions of video ideas i'm actually going to love you and leave you guys and i'll see you in the next video Bye. Bye.